Fox 15 and KLAF NBC News 15 today starts now. Good Monday morning and welcome back. You're watching News 15 today. I'm Alex Worstel. Turning to our top story this morning, a likely tornado caused damage near Church Point, tossing mobile homes and uprooting trees. Meteorologist Corey Smith has the latest from Church Point. It's here on Prudence Highway. We're around 8.40 p.m. on Sunday. A tornado moved through the area. Debris was detected on the radar as the storm moved through. And unfortunately, here at the ground, multiple homes destroyed here. You can see some of the damage behind me. Crews here overnight working to fix power lines and clear the scene. And as the sun comes up in the morning, those who live in the area will see the true scale of the damage. Storm Sunday evening was already tornado warned as it moved through Evangeline and St. Landry parishes. It once again spun up as it moved into Acadia Parish just north of Church Point. That's when Storm Team 15 radar picked up debris being lofted into the air. And it, as of now, it tore up that we know of four, uh, uh, three trailer houses, one house for sure. We have several sent to the hospitals, numerous hospitals in the area, but uh, some severe injuries, some minor injuries. We have had uh, some adults and children involved, but as of right now, everybody is accounted for, as we know of, between the sheriff's department and the family members. This viewer video sent into News 15 shows another possible tornado from a very active Sunday afternoon and evening, moving from Mamu towards Eunice. The same storm would drop a tornado that would move through Church Point. While the sun is expected to be out on Monday, those here in Church Point are going to be cleaning up the mess left by storms. From Church Point, meteorologist Corey Smith, News 15. Well, that tornado in Acadia Parish was one of several possible tornadoes that occurred as storms moved through Acadiana on Sunday evening. And speaking of, Adam, there were 